All right, so this problem says name a point that is root two away from negative one, five. Well, we know the distance formula is x two minus x one squared plus y two minus y one squared. And what we have is the distance, this is the distance, and we have an x, we have x and a y. Let's call it x one and y one. So we need to find the other point, x2, y2. So let's see if we can plug in these, in prob these numbers and see. So there's my distance equals the square root of, I don't know x2 yet, but it's minus negative 1 squared plus, I don't know my y2 yet, but it's minus y1 squared. So there's my equation. And how many solutions are there to that equation? Right, there's a ton of solutions, right? Because yeah. that's just what, what you really have. If think about this point. If you have the point negative 1, 5, it's going to be like up here somewhere. Square root of 2 away from that is, a, is basically a circle. It's this point, 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 it's this point. So there's actually an infinite number of points that you can choose. So all you have to do is find one that works. That's it. So let's simplify this a little bit to make it a little bit easier. So let's get rid of the square roots on both sides. So we've got x2 plus 1 squared plus y2 minus 5 squared. So there's a little bit easier equation to look at. And by the way, this is the equation of a circle also. So we, we know that this is a circle. You'll learn that later in, in other math classes. So all we have to do is just find a point. Let's just plug in, let's find this point right here. That seems like an easy one to find. What's the x value for that one? It's zero. That's why I picked it, because it'd be easy to plug it in. So let's plug in zero. And what are we gonna get? Two equals one squared, which is one, right? Plus y squared. Y to minus 5 squared. So now let's solve this equation. How do I solve this equation algebraically? I'm trying to get y by itself, right? I'm trying to find out what y is. So you take one and you over Subtract one from both sides. Good. Now how do I, what do I get rid of next? I'm just going to write y instead of y sub 2 because it's the same thing. Now what? Get rid of that yeah. by doing what? Square root. Taking the square root, good. And don't forget when you do that, that it's actually plus or minus. Yeah. Okay, so we actually have two answers to this. Because look, see how there's two points? One is there and one is there. It doesn't matter which one we pick, but we have two answers. So there's our equation. So y equals five plus or minus one. So we actually found two points. Pick, pick a point, any point. Five plus one is six. Five minus one is four. Either one of those points is our point. So what is the point? The point is, remember we picked the zero for the y, and the other value is four or six. Either one would work. And to make sure, what you could do is now use the distance formula to see what the distance is between those. The x's are one away. So 1 squared, the y's are 1 away. 1 squared plus 1 squared is the square root of 1 squared plus 1 squared, which is the square root of 2, so that checks out. So your answer, again, is 0, 4, or you could have said 0, 6, or you could have picked any other number on this circle by just picking a different x value and finding it and plugging it in.